Hi guys, so it's just going to be a quick little video. I have a whole vacuum cluster right here. So I got one, two, three, four, five right here. I got five of these machines right here. And yeah. So it's going to be a quick video. And yeah, let's get started. So at first I got the door double. Um, so, so we got the door double, power max, upright, and this is really good addition. And it's just kind of um pretty clean. Yeah. Door double is super clean. And yeah. Yeah, it was pretty clean. Well, yeah, it's still pretty clean lately. I didn't really use this one much because I've been really, really busy <clears throat> lately. I've been really, really busy lately. Like, I am. Um, well, I was just like doing stuff and I didn't have time to do a vacuum video, so um, that's why I'm just going to do one. Well, I did quite a few vacuum videos, but not a whole lot because I've been really busy lately. Playing my toys. <laughs> Literally, I was playing my toys all the time. And yeah. We have a really nice place, guys. Um, and it says 847. It's 847 in the afternoon. Okay. We're so, gonna be brushing your teeth yeah. as soon as I'm done with the. <laughs> so, yeah. We're gonna make this video real quick, guys. So, yeah. So, the door devil has got no issues. I was just a um, button that's all staying in the butt. That's. Well. That's one issue. Well, the issue is, is the, well, I, well, it's clean up with one hand all the time. And I like, open it up when I'm doing like a review. Clean up with one hand. That was kind of annoying, man. I don't even like that. But, that's the one issue. But, um, another issue, well, this is on those two buttons, well, the other one on the side here, um, on the side there, can you put it to empty, like, have to, like, um, have to, like, hit it once, and it opens, so that's kind of annoying, but, I do like it, so I was all the same but there's no reasons like Brussels good, high adjustment is good, coral is good, holes, the handle, and it's in really good addition and the toy using it. Yeah, so it's a dark devil upright. That's too much of the um auric XL. Here's the yeah, this is the um auric XL upright. And this one's in really good distance. And there's not there's no issues with this thing. Well well there's like there's like a couple issues with this thing. Well one issue yeah, that's like well, yeah, there's like two issues this um, thing. Yeah, there's like two issues with this work. So, um, the one issue with this is the, um, cord. Every time when I, like, wrap the cord, it gets, like, stuck on this cord. So it's not really good thing, but it's still, like, it's pretty neat. And another issue is on this thing is 
Wait. Let me try when I like vacuum. Now I'm gonna I'm not gonna give a story because it's really loud and Well, I don't care if it's loud. I don't care if it's loud. I just wanna turn I don't wanna turn on right now because people are in bed I don't wanna like I don't wanna how loud this guy was scared so we if I risk but yeah, that's okay, I'm not gonna do that. I'm I'm gonna get it straight tomorrow. Well, I don't care if it's loud. I don't care if this thing's loud, I still like it. Even if it's loud, I still like it. Yeah, I don't care if it's loud, guys. Yeah. Yeah, I don't care if it's loud, it's still a real good vacuum. Yeah, even if it's loud, it's still a pretty piece of vacuum. The door goes a lot quieter to this one. I like this one better because it's, it's a really good vacuum. I would not want to this one in the last link, but two seconds, okay? So, yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, the one that's new is the cord. It's stuck on the cord hook. <laughs> well, yeah. So, I want to talk about that. So, I'm talking about the weight right now. So, this new is on the weight. Um, the weight on this vacuum is, when I tell my like, vacuum this thing, it's, like, really hard to push. Like, it's, like, normal, it's hard to push. Like, my arms get kind of slimy. She feeds the, she, well, yeah, she feeds the shark. But, yeah, these so are hard to push. There was a pretty easy push. This, just these two are hard to push. But, now something to this is the rip, but it's still a pretty good vacuum, and I, that's what I'm using it. So, yeah, I'm just going to the whistle. So, yeah, we're going to yeah. So, we're officially going to get right now. It's going to the whistle. So this was the uh, Bissell Power Force Compact. It's a really lightweight vacuum. And I'm actually using it. And there's like a few issues with this thing. Well, one issue with it is, um, it's not a lot of the weight. The weight is pretty easy to push. Well, yeah, the one issue with this thing is the hose. Well, well, no, not how, sorry. <laughs> well, well, the issue is when I like empty it, or well, when I'm done emptying the vacuum, I have to like hit it, or well, I have to like click it, please. So that's kind of annoying, and I don't even like that, but it's still the vacuum. So yeah. And another, and another issue is. It doesn't even stand out, stand out with a lit stress hose. Every time I let, like stress the hose, it like tips over. Sometimes the crust still falls out. Hey Christian, and that's not a good thing. Shut it down now because those against the wall. But that's okay. It's still pretty decent vacuum. So yeah. Um, and another issue is the wind down. Sometimes the wind down is just kind of weird when I turn it off. Sometimes it sounds normal, sometimes it sounds weird. But, that's an issue. But, I like this girl. Yeah. And let's move to the black dipper. This one has a couple issues. So, um, this Should one's late. Like, to put them away, honey. Yeah, this one is also light, so um, the issue is on this one is it falls all the time. Well, sometimes, but that's good. So, yeah. And, yeah, that's the issue, but I still like it. And another issue is the cord. I wish the cord was, like, long cord. Um, but... That's okay. Still pretty easy back and that's an issue, but also big deal. <laughs> but 
And the rest here is it doesn't even like get full of dirt. It just like literally it just, just like gets stuck between the flap. So that's kinda of annoying in the in the way that but I still like it. It's pretty decent. So yeah. That's the least of salt. This one's in really good this one. It's really heavy. So yeah. Yeah, it's pretty heavy, so yeah. So, there was like a couple issues with this one. So, an issue is button. Like, no it won't. When I push that button, this button doesn't, you know, like, open. It just like stays there. That's very annoying. That button is just, like, that button is garbage, so yeah. But I still like it, it's pretty neat. And another issue is the green light sometimes doesn't work, and that's kind of annoying. And I don't usually even like that, but it's still a pretty decent vacuum. And yeah, another issue is this. Or a hose. Every time when I like take this or hose out, it's pain in the butt. Like, it's no real. It's like, it's, it's like a sparkle. I don't know why. And that's kind of annoying. And I don't really like that. So it's still a pretty good vacuum. So yeah, that was my vacuum question. So this video is getting a little bit longer. So I gotta like stop me right now. So yeah. So that was my vacuum question. So. Yeah, and <clears throat> yeah, so be sure to subscribe to my channel and oh, see you in the next one, but it will be too late tomorrow. Yeah, so this is the video for tonight, all right? Well, I was gonna do it, I was gonna do like a few more tonight, but I guess I, hmm, well, I was going to, but, because I changed my mind, I want to. Well, I was going to, hey, but. I need you to shut it down, and we're done on the phone. This, this time, we'll be right now, so, yeah. Hey, see you tomorrow. Bye.